What's up? It's Trainer Jack here. Just got done with a little uh, metabolic conditioning workout and I thought I'd go ahead and do the FAQ today since I didn't get the chance to do one earlier. I just got asked, uh, I think it was a couple weeks ago by a friend of mine, Jack, I'm a runner. Jack, I'm into working out. Uh, what kind of shoes? Looks like I got some on my face right there. Uh, what kind of shoes should I be wearing? And do they need to be special? Like, do I need a special kind of orthotic or anything to balance out my heel to toe drop? Or if you've got high arches or low arches? I just read a great article recently that presented some interesting research on that we don't think anymore that you need to necessarily have like an arch supported shoe if you have a lot of supination or rise in the middle of your foot or if you're pronated to wear flatter shoes to try to change that it's really just what you're comfortable in so when you go to the store don't necessarily think oh i have to have you know a certain nike reebok mizuno whatever you prefer with a high arch uh, if you have a high arch or a drop if you've got a flat foot like mine for instance just put on whatever's comfortable i've got a few different kinds of running and athletic shoes in my closet right now i've got a toe shoe i've got the fila skeletos and i use that for lifting i've run it a few times but you always got to be careful with your achilles tendon and your gastrocnemius and your soleus your bigger muscles in the calf when uh you're starting to run in those you just have to slowly condition up into them i've got a pair of brooks that are completely flat they're more of like a minimal shoe i just got a pair of nikes on a great sale a pair of nike freeze that's got a pretty high rise um in the arch for arch support and i just got done with a pair of reeboks that are whatever the CrossFit versions, the real flex is what they are. And the only pain in the butt with those is you always get little rocks and things on the trail stuck in your shoe. But uh, so anyways, I don't want to digress too far, but get whatever shoe's comfortable. Have a couple different pairs. I recommend changing them up. One, you won't wear out one pair of shoes so fast. And two, it'll keep kind of the muscles and the tendons and everything in your foot guessing when you go out to run. And that leaves them a little more adaptable. Uh, which is actually a great injury preventative. But uh, anyways, if you have any other questions, like I said, you're always free to, uh, if you got my number, call me, text me, email me at trainerjackw at gmail.com. And uh, looking forward to the next video. I'll talk to you guys soon. See ya.